Thank you all for coming this morning. Uh, we are proud uh, to announce today um, the You Are In um, initiative between, the, between Shelton State Community College and the Tuscaloosa City Schools. As part of our work in the Tuscaloosa City Schools, we want to make sure that every graduating senior this May is either enrolled, enlisted, or employed upon graduation. And this partnership with Shelton State Community College right here in Tuscaloosa allows us to make sure that every student graduating in May has a plan after high school. And Shelton State certainly is one of those options. Yeah, and we want to say from Shelton State that we're excited to let every graduate know that we have a place for them at Shelton State. Hence the you are in. You are in at Shelton State and you can become a college student. So we're going to be out this week uh, to get every student that is graduating this, this spring uh, read, or going through the application process and getting into the registration process to come to Shelton State Community College. We already have a good number of our seniors who are graduating in May. They're already committed to either a four-year university, a two-year two college, to a career right here in our, in our area, or enlisted in the military. But we want to make sure all of our students are aware of this opportunity with Shelton State Community College um, to either finalize that plan before graduation, or if the current plans don't work out, Shelton State Community College is a partner here in town ready for all of our students. Dr. Gary, how much of a percentage is there of graduating seniors who fall into the category of not knowing where they want to go and what they want to do that would fit into the URN? So right now we have, we have about a 700 student graduating class and we're about a hundred of those students who are still finalizing their plans. Um, a majority of our students have already verified a post-graduation plan um, and they may still be eligible to, to jump into Shelton State if their current plans don't work. But the 100 students that were, who are working now to, to graduate and to finalize their plan, this certainly would be one of the available options for them. What do you do to familiarize them with Shelton and opportunities and classes that are there for them, uh, even if they're not really up on it, even though they live in the Tuscaloosa? On our part, the first thing that's really important for our students to know is that they have a community college right here in Tuscaloosa they can attend the day they graduate high school. And that's, that's part of what today is, making, uh, making our community aware of Shelton State as a partner. Um, Shelton State will be on our campuses in the coming days to provide advising and get, our, get students directly enrolled. Um, the goal is to make it seamless. We want our students to walk across the Tuscaloosa City School stage and right into their path, whether it's enroll, enrolled, enlisted, or employed. And Shelton State, of course, has structures in place to help our students get into the program. Dr. Gary, I'm guessing this is the first of its kind partnership for Shelton and Tuscaloosa City Schools. How big is this to offer this bridge to allow graduating seniors to walk right into a community college? That's, that seems pretty this is. Um, it speaks to the partnership that we have with, with Shelton State Community College. Um, it speaks to Shelton State um, being innovative and thinking differently on how they can support K-12. Um, but for us, what is most impactful is that every student walking across our stage has a verified plan the day he or she graduates. And Shelton State Community College is one of those options for our students. We just want to make sure students in our community are successful, and Shelton State is certainly one of those options. This question is for both of you. Dr. Cox, you can yeah. start. How did this come about? Uh, I got a phone call actually one morning after we had been working on some dual enrollment planning and Dr. Derry called and said, Chris, I have an idea. And he said, it's crazy. And I said, and he said, I only need two minutes. I said, you can take 30. But long story short, he told me, why does, not, why does every student not get this opportunity? And, said, and I, I immediately said, we can make this happen. And uh, with Amanda Harvison, who is our dean of students, and we've got a recruiter here, TJ, they put their heads together and worked with the team here at the city schools, and here we are. How does this help Shelton in terms of enrollment or putting it on the minds of the student body in the immediate area that you guys are an option for? Yeah, I, I think what it does for our students is it doesn't matter what your GPA is. It doesn't matter what your skill set is. If you graduate from Tuscaloosa City Schools, you can be a student with us. And we have a pathway for you to learn a skill, to get, a, get college credit, to transfer to University of Alabama. We have all of those options um, for every student. So we just need to bring awareness to every student that they're in. 
you are in as a student at Shelton State Community College. Take us through the, the steps or the process for them to do. Is it just a two-step process? And if so, just talk well, about it. What will happen is this week, we will have a team of four to five people on campus, on each campus this week. And when that student comes and goes through the application process, they will immediately get an advisor at Shelton State. That advisor will then start helping them work through the process of uh, going through registration if that is indeed what they want. Uh, if they're wanting to go into some sort of skilled training that might not be a four credit program, that advisor will be able to help put them on that pathway to get them where they need to go. And I think that goes back to the work that the whole city and the county's doing from the chamber to West Alabama Works. We're helping to fill that need for economic development and get workers in the pipeline here in Tuscaloosa. Dr. Gary, a question for you, sir. Um, nowadays, a lot of students are choosing not to go to four-year schools, and two-year schools are, are a good option for them to, to get their degrees and to go into whatever field they, um, they want to get into. So with that said, with this new partnership, how does that make that, you know, that goal for them better, easier? Yeah, so years ago, our, our goal was graduation. A diploma in a student's hand was our goal. And we've changed that. That's no longer our goal. As we elevate expectations in the city of Tuscaloosa, um, you have to elevate what that diploma is and what it means. So when our students graduate, we want them to graduate with a diploma plus. And if that plus is college credit as part of Elevate with dual enrollment, if it's a career, uh, a career technology credential, that's good. We just want to make sure that our students, when they walk across the stage, they are ready for what is next and that they already have some things in their hand for that. So this partner with Shelton State is, is a big piece of that, right? All we care about is that our students, they engage in post-graduation education. That can be directly in a career field, that can be at Shelton State or a four-year college. We just want them to pursue the path that is of interest for them um, and where they can be highly successful. This work with Shelton State, it really helps us move that needle faster because every student walking across our stage can go right into Shelton State to go right into a career or pursue the two year to move to a four year. There are so many paths at Shelton State our students can take advantage of and we just wanna make that as a seamless transition for our, children, for our students. I'm going to ask, I'm going to answer a question you didn't ask. Um, and I'm going to, if I can, I'm just going to speak directly to our parents of graduating seniors. Um, a big part of this is to make sure that your senior walking across the stage in May from the Tuscaloosa City Schools has a defined plan. What we don't want is a senior walking across the stage uncertain. And the work here with Shelton State, but there are many other opportunities right here in Tuscaloosa for our students to be engaged in career or college or enlist. And we just want to make sure our parents have that conversation with their students before graduation about that plan and that it's a verified plan. There are so many opportunities right here in Tuscaloosa and we believe our students are ready for those opportunities and we want them to thrive. And I, I will piggyback off of that statement is to say to the parents of the Tuscaloosa City School students that are graduating is once they come to us, we believe whatever program they choose, we can show evidence their success. Students are leaving our programs, transferring successfully, or going into jobs and employment in this community that are, that are giving them livable wages, wages that are outstanding. All of our students that graduate our career programs are getting quality jobs that, that, are, um, that are really um, equipping them to be able to support a family. 